It's finally time for WWE My GM. Don't laugh. That's the best I could do. It is definitely not photoshopped. I didn't even notice that. I just know you don't have that much drip. Getting roasted by Mark, well here you go. Last year I competed against Adam Pierce. And in case you were wondering how big are Adam's balls, I actually lost. Well this year, it's going to be a little bit different. You have me running Raw this time. You have Adam Pierce running SmackDown. You have Eric Bischoff running WCW. Allery looks like a perfect set of general managers. Well, people, I have a surprise. I'm going to run NXT 2. Psych. I'm all about the black and gold. Yes, people, Mark is going to run N. XT. I'm gonna copy AEW. So here you go, the great one, Adam Pierce, Eric Bischoff, and Mark. I think we're gonna have a lot of fun. These are going to be the settings. Season 1. I don't care about that, it ain't my first rodeo. I lost previously, so I, I know. Okay, people, first draft pick. We can't go wrong with Roman Reigns. And SmackDown picks Becky Lynch. Uh, WCW picks Asuka. And Mark picks... Uh, no! No! I swear to God, if I accidentally didn't record, I'm going to do something to myself. People, I picked Mark for NXT, and he picked Alexa Bliss. That is the most... I almost... I'm almost I almost want to try to convince you that I didn't do this. That's the perfect moment in my YouTube career! Why are you surprised? Of course I'm going to pick Alexia Bliss! That's the best thing that ever happened. My second pick is Cody Rhodes. Of course it is. And SmackDown picks John Cena. Great pick from SmackDown. Shina Baszler, they're all about them women. Not usual for WCW. Of course, Mark picks Dewdrop. And we are going to pick Edge, the rated R superstar. SmackDown picks MVP. Man, these draft picks are weird as hell. I can't even explain them. Finn Balor to WCW. Finn Balor was great. Oh no. Kevin Owens to NXT. He was great in Ring of Honor. Money Night Raw picks Randy Orton. Uh, SmackDown picks Seth freaking Rollins. Uh, WCW picks Angelo Dawkins. Mark Vujagat. Uh, Logan Paul. International sensation. And we are going to pick man. Our picks do not not make any sense I perfectly understand that but it's great for YouTube thumbnails Bobby Lashley is going to Monday Night Raw Bianca Belair to smack it down WCW picks carrying cross great pick from WCW Shinsuke Nakamura <laughs> okay okay I hear you uh, but we are picking Rhea Ripley my favorite women's wrestler of course I'll pick Rhea Ripley Smackdown picks uh, Dakota Kai WCW picks our truth and Mark picks Julius Creed. Okay, give me those recommendations. Uh, we are picking a uh, Damien Priest is going to Monday Night Raw. Smackdown picks Gunta. I hate you, Smackdown. I wanted to pick Gunta. The Miz. Okay. Jay Uso. Charlotte Flair is a specialist. Works for me. Charlotte is going to Monday Night Raw. Smackdown picks Mustafa Ali. WCW picks Io Sky. Uh, okay, NXT picks Commander Aziz! I love Commander Aziz! And then we are... Man, these recommendations... Well, okay, Bailey. My, my whole women's roster is heels. Sami Zayn. Okay, great pick, great pick. Uh, Raquel Rodriguez. Okay, okay. And he picked... Liv Morgan is almost as good as Alexa Bliss. I get it, I get it. You're probably wondering, the great one. You forgot about someone. Your favorite WWE wrestler. No, I didn't. It's Monday Night Raw. Who's coming? Who's coming right now? Certainly not me. It's me, Mahan, coming to Raw. Okay, okay. Kofi is going to WCW. NXT picks Tamina. He's all about them women, I see. Okay. Uh, we are going to pick Matt Riddle because Randy is on Raw. Uh, Lacey Evans. Okay, okay. Uh, Omaz, the greatest WWE superstar. Uh, Zoe Stark. Okay, I have the best roster, man. By far. By far. Uh, okay, give me those recommendations. Apollo Crews, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But Nikki's ass works 
because she's a baby face. I believe so. Is she? Did I just make a mistake? Okay. <clears throat> uh huh. Okay, okay, okay. Let's 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 try to figure this out. Who do we want on Raw? Not a lot of people. I want Ricochet. I want Ricochet. He's coming to Raw. JD. Okay. Okay. WCW. Indy Hartwell. And Montez Ford. We don't have Giants. Now we do. Shanky's going to Raw. SmackDown picks Eric. WCW picks Tyler Bate. Uh, NXT picks Dexter Loomis. Okay. Okay. Ah, man. I mean, we do have Bobby, so let's get uh, the Hurt Business back. Of oh, okay, they did they, they did not choose Cedric, Chad Gable. I wish I picked Chad. D do not pick Cedric. Oh, he didn't pick him. Welcome to A E NXT. Okay, he's done. We can pick Cedric. You do not have enough cash to draft this superstar. We're broke. Ah. Uh. Let's move on. That's our draft. This is the funniest shit I've ever seen in my entire life. But I mean, look at this roster. Elite. All elite wrestling. Wait a minute, that's copyrighted. Oh, they picked Apollo Crews. Nobody picks Cedric. Okay. And SmackDown picks nothing. So people, these are the rosters. Look at that, man. Having multiple brands competing is great. Not because it's fun, I just don't wanna lose. Hall of Fame, you can already put me in that. San Diego, season one, week one. A uh, great one, good to talk to you. Just checking in to make sure Roy is ready for new season. Feeling confident? Uh, with the roster we have, I think we'll do okay. Good, I'm expecting big things of Raw this season. Make it an amazing show. Uh, hey, great one. I just wanted to let you know that I plan on taking WCW to the top of power rankings and staying here. Good luck, I guess. I have the Raw and show running capabilities to do it. I don't think Raw stands a chance. You really think you can contend with us when we have superstars like Asuka? Get real. Well, boy, we have Veer Mother F Mahan. WWE Champion, Roman Reigns, Women's Champion. Charlotte is taking that belt. Okay, so this is brand new territory for me. It's familiar, but some things I just don't understand. So bear with me. I'm learning as well. This is war. Basically with this, three random selected superstars cannot compete in opposite shows. Of course, we are going to do that to Adam Pierce because he beat me. Of course. I think we shouldn't sign anyone, even though I want to sign Drew, I want to sign Jimmy, I want to sign Rey Mysterio. Man, this is tempting, but we don't have the cash. We need to book a show. One day, baby. One day. So when it comes to show logistics, we can't do much, but let's book our show. And thankfully this year, a lot more options, man. A lot more options. Okay, so the show is not looking very good. My roster is tiny. The first match is the women's championship match. Charlotte Flair versus Nikki's ass. It's a normal match and we have to do this because Nikki is the only babyface. Well, Rhea Ripley is turning face too. This I cannot explain, uh, but two goats just teaming up. That's that's all you really need, need to know. My roster is tiny. I need variety on my show. Cody is calling out Roman. Shanky versus Shelton Benjamin steel cage match. I mean, once in a lifetime. Charity, because we need fans. And of course, the WWE United States Championship. Edge versus Bob Lashley. Extreme Rules match, because we are going to crown our first champion championship match. Uh, the end championship match in the beginning. I think that should work, right? Well, uh, let's see. And do we have a new women's champion? No, Charlotte retains, thankfully. And it was good. Well, that's actually surprising that honestly surprised me role change okay she's a baby face now and of course we have uh amazing just goats goats matt riddle and randy orton one mediocre i thought it's gonna be worse honestly so i'm not even disappointed okay okay excellent excellent happy to see that uh five stars already don't even need to look at that one uh, okay five stars that's better than i thought it would be giant versus cruiser Okay, gotcha. Charity. Okay, more fans. I appreciate that. Now it's time for the United States 
championship. I still have no idea how to explain these wrestlers why we're wrestling in a gym. At the beginning it seemed like Edge has the upper hand, but then the almighty Bobby Lashley showed what he's all about. The Rated R Superstar came back with Edge O'Matic. After his spine buster, Edge immediately got up and went to get his steel chair. Unfortunately, it backfired. Bobby Lashley took out Edge at ringside and then started beating him with the steel chair. Once we got back into the ring, Edge finally got the upper hand. He picked up the kendo stick and started beating the living shit out of Bobby Lashley. Bobby tried to get out, but ate a face breaker knee smash instead. Bobby got the steel steps, seems like that was a big mistake, especially considering the fact Edge broke his penis. Bobby made a big mistake by losing focus. He tried to hit Edge, but got speared instead. One. Two, and a kick out at two, Edge can't believe it. Bobby didn't make the same mistake twice. Still ate a rough powerbomb, an execution on steel steps, and even that couldn't get the job done. Edge had enough, he decided to end things right here, right now, with a nice spear, except he got DDT'd. Then it seemed like Lashley was toying around with Edge. The match got absolutely brutal when Bobby got them steel steps. But no matter how many times Edge got hit, he still got up. All of that for the United States Championship. But somehow Edge dodged the attack, speared Bobby Lashley, one, two, Three. Edge is the new United States Champion of a Monday Night Raw. What a match. That was great. I absolutely loved the finish of this one. And it was good. I would give it more stars, but... I mean, I can't complain. SmackDown's card is hella weird. WCW got that hardcore championship. I need to see who won. Omas is your hardcore champion. Of course, of course, Mark made Alexa win. If somehow, some way, Mark made Logan Paul his NXT champion, I think it's not actually Mark, it's someone pretending to be a Mark. Or he no longer likes wrestling, but that's unrealistic. Uh, who won? Kevin Owens, of course. Ring of Honor original! Look at that, we actually did just fine! We had a good opener, good mid-card match, another good mid-card match, and main event was not so good. But I can't possibly compete against Mark. Man, having four shows is so much more fun. We have a budget of $106,000, that is great. We gained quite a few fans. Rhea, a good guy? Never saw it coming. Yes, because she's a good girl. Well, of course, Mark has the best show of them all, but we are second. NXT, Monday Night Raw, WCW, and SmackDown. These balls ain't so big after all, huh, Adam? Hey, what was that stunt you pulled last show? Well, no shit happens. You like that? Gotta get dirty if you wanna win, of course. That's what I would say. If you want to play that way, fine. Watch your back. You gonna drop your balls on me? Listen, I need to wipe that smug smile off Edge's face after that loss. I wanna fight him again within the next two weeks. Okay, I can't do that. You're literally in a rivalry, Bobby. Of course. Good. I'll show everyone who's the real winner this time. We got a new arena. We have some money. Gem Assistant is not uh, saying much right now. But Riddle and Randy Orton work well together as a tag team. Well, no sh- Oh, and what is that? I'm number two. Great start. So that's gonna be it for today. Uh, in the next episode, I'll play more weeks, but we drafted the roster. We got introduced to the mode. I think that's enough. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, smash that like and watch the next episode. Thank you very much. You're number two, general manager. I'm not even mad, you can't beat Mark. Peace, love and hugs. It's been a pleasure.